Welcome back. We're the Bourbon Junkies. He's on his phone, and I'm Sean. Dude, don't, you're not blaming me for being on my phone when you rant cold started that one up, dude. Maker's Mark 46 cast strength. Is it any good? The old one was. Oh, no. Wait, wait. It's a screw cap. There's no way we're going to screw cap. It's a $65, I mean, a $65 screw cap. $65 bottle. All right. That hey, let, it, hey, let it be known that our bourbon's cheaper than this. <laughs> All right. There's nothing better, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. Should be. Legacy. Right. Whoa. <laughs> Throat goat makers, dude. Holy shit. I think I got to cut that. I don't know if you do. <laughs> All right, listen, $65, Maker's Mark French Toasted Oak Stave. One of my favorite actual Maker's right. products oh. is the, the 46 cask. We've never done it before. We've talked a lot about it. Yeah. We've recommended this bottle to a lot of people. Said we should finally do one. We've put the 46 cast rank in blinds and lists, I believe. Oh. This is a new label. They redid it. It used to be like that tall, rounded like bottle. Um, the old have, bottle looked cooler. Do we have one of the old ones? We I do. Don't. We have one of the old bottles. It's the same as the license plate bottles. You know what they had though? Yeah, well, how, what a weird transition. Because normal, is, wait, is normal, is normal Maker's Cast Strengths a cork too and it's in that glass? Yeah. Why, why, are, that's such a weird. Yeah, I don't know. Dang, this that's... bottle was so much better. It's just, it's cooler. This feels more like normal Maker's Mark. Which they probably sell more in this bottle because it looks like normal makers. Yeah. This but, is like you got the answers to someone that got an A. Mm -hmm. and you're like, don't make it obvious. Just get a B plus. Yeah. And they mm -hmm. came out with that label. B minus. Yeah. Listen. I don't know. Before we get back into this video oh, today that you're already so watching, drink. we're going to tell you about our favorite pre-drink drink. So this is a scientifically engineered probiotic that all you have to do is if you're going to do so a little bit of drinking, you take one of these, you go. Oh about an hour before you drink and yep. then you know you drink responsibly you have some drinks you have some water yeah. you're gonna wake up feeling way better in the morning yeah trust me i've proven this true we keep these on hand for tuesday night specifically honestly the zbiotics is a thing that we tested before we even started working with zbiotics you can go subscribe over there you can get like our use our discount code these things help us on wednesdays in a weekly basis <clears throat> that would be a basis, but anyways, basis. what it does is it helps your stomach break down a little bit of the byproduct of alcohol digestion. Yeah. You get the, the acetaldehyde build up. That's what up, they call it. And uh, that's what makes you kind of feel not so good in the morning. This helps you break that down. Yeah. So your liver doesn't have to work so hard. Which yeah. honestly, very good thing for everybody involved. Yeah. So honestly, z -Box is something that we use and love for real. If you guys want to check them out, go ahead and click the link in the description down below. Just yep. click that link, do that, and then just subscribe. You get them like you can get them on a monthly basis. It's freaking perfect. The so, cheapest, best way to do it. Yeah. Shout out to Zbiotics for working with the channel. We love them. You guys should try them out. We know you'll love them too. Back to the video. So Maker's 46 cast strength. This is just the new updated bottle version, whatever. So 110 proof. Low. Still low smells cast amazing. Smells really good. I don't normally like. I'm not a. I it, say that I put makers first the last time. So we this isn't as like rosy and flower petal this as red like fruit. the cast strength regular makers is like that one is like straight potpourri. Regular makers cast strengths, one of my least favorite makers mark products. Mm -hmm. The normal makers come to find out is pretty damn good. Obviously very drinkable. They sell a kajillion it's units good. a year. Um, this before kind of hard to find. I think really easy to find. Now you can get these at like Costco's. Yeah, you they had a case stack at our Costco. Yeah, you can get these. I got this not even at Costco, just a random liquor store. This is just good. Like, this is going to be a nice short and sweet review. Because smells like chocolate. This is just good. It's got a ton of that, like, raspberry chocolate in the finish. Just phenomenal. Proof, one of my favorites. What, what, 110? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, it's just really freaking solid, man. 110 is your favorite proof. I think, I, I think it's lowering over time. Yeah. I think it's 100 now. I think we're gonna just. Is that I, just the, the heartburn? Yeah, I think yeah. I think as I get old, <laughs> like I think I'm getting close to that 100 to 108 range. I, um, just because of Jack 12. We but. have come down on that. We used to say like 115 was yeah. our favorite, and now I, I recently said about 107. Yeah, like somewhere in that yep. that range. I'll go up to 112. You know, I'll yeah. dabble. 
Man, it's just, it's it super like sweet. A chocolate covered cherry, like a cherry cordial almost. I was thinking chocolate covered strawberry. Fair. Red just fruit, chocolate. Crushable. Sweet. It has, honestly, like the linger is nice. Like this is for real. I'm glad that it still tastes like this in this bottle. Mm -hmm. This is like a new, of the new version. So like, this is a just purchased. So this isn't like, oh, we bought this like a year ago and maybe it's changed since then. This is like a brand new current version. This is actually, this is 65 bucks. That's a great bottle of whiskey. Yeah. I really do think that that would compete with like the old 1920 from Old Forest. Oh, easily. From like a value king yeah. perspective. Um, I would say that the we're big fans of French oak as it stands. Yeah. Anyways, the French oak always adds that like chocolate and like a really oily mouthfeel. And this is no exception to that. It just completely coats the inside of your mouth. You can really like move it around at the 110, get everything out of it. It's a good drink. It's just good. There's yeah. nothing wrong with it. Like it all. 65, not a problem. I get just Viscosity, a hint not a of citrus. Um, the nose and the palate are identical to one another, like realistically. I didn't find like a bunch of new stuff. It's not the most complex whiskey on the planet, but it's not supposed to be. Mm. Um, and then a little bit of marzipan. I get a little almond note in the, the finish. No? Marzipan? No. Every time somebody says marzipan, I immediately think marsupial. No. I just do. It's not it. It goes from a food to an animal, which <clears throat> okay. could also be a food. There's a hint of almond in the finish for me. So um, like if you had uh, like a Hershey's almond bar, like a little, little bit, you don't like almond. Who, I don't know who in the world buys Hershey's <laughs> almond to keep that line in business. That's some bullshit. Do you know what the, everybody knows, Hershey's, just OG Hershey's, number one. Oh, Hershey's God. cookies and cream, oh. number two. After that, stop making different ones. What is what else is there? Hershey Reese's would be great. Do they own Reese's? Make a Reese's one, because that'd be fantastic. Make a peanut butter one. Some old people say Reese's. Reese's? That's yeah. not the real Reese's word. Reese's peanut butter cup? Did you miss English? I'm not good at it. Are you, you you're the guy? Yeah. You're the guy that's gonna call people out on mispronouncing mm -hmm. words. We just went marzipan to mar marsupial, <laughs> but saying Reese's, you said Costco's earlier too. Those two There's have There's no the same. S on Costco, sir. Costco has it. I think I was. I think the no, rest is close. You together. said our Costco's. I think they were close. No, I don't. I don't call it Costco's ever. That's good. Great. Sixty-five bucks. A. Flat Honestly, a. it the, tastes. Everyone like- Everyone should own a bottle. Chocolate. Of it tastes like strawberries. It has a nice finish. The viscosity is a nice amount of viscosity. Um, the price isn't bad at all, and it hasn't gone up drastically, I think it's which is a awesome. Very high standard of a good cast strength wheated bourbon. I think this is a really great standard of a legacy distillery. Yeah. I think that all $60 bottles from legacy distilleries should be as good as that. We would have said, we said that with an old Forrester 1920, the, pre, the old label, we liked a lot. The new label, the, we've only had one or two, but we didn't love those ones as much. Yeah. This just is like stereotypical. If you were at a bar and they had a shitty list and they had this, you'd be saved. You're be good. Ecstatic. You don't have to worry about it. So if they had regular cast ring though, less, less I stuff. wouldn't even buy the regular cast ring. Swear to God. I, yeah. and I won't, I, the bottle that we have of the regular cast ring is mostly full and four years old. The label fell, up, yeah. fell off. Yeah, I bought that without the label on it. Around so long. I bought oh. that without the label on it. I thought it at a fell liquor off store. in the, the hut. Nope. Didn't have a label on it. I thought it was a special one. It's <laughs> not. Nah. <laughs> that's a buy for sure. That was a special one. All that's right, fantastic. Cool. That's us. That is really good. This is if the license plate series were as good as this, which none of them have been yet. They're good. Um, then you know you wouldn't have a need for that. But SE four was really good. Mm. Mm. Good job, makers. See you guys later. I'm gonna sit you somewhere. I love French oak. Dude. Hey, I've been looking for this for the longest time. It's and it's blended, probably been there been for the longest the time. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's a bottle opener. <laughs> On the floor. <laughs> you are so grumpy. Yeah, you are. Yes.